What's up guys? So this past weekend was fishing opener 2021 for Minnesota, the walleye opener. Um, we went out Saturday out of Morris Point. We did okay. A lot of people were doing really good around us and we kept moving, we kept switching, we kept doing all kinds of stuff and it didn't seem to matter. We were picking up fish, but a lot of them were little fish and we weren't getting very many of them. So we didn't get a lot of footage that day. The next day we went over to the Warroad side. And uh, it was pretty nice when we launched, and then, you know, we were catching some really nice fish. The wind was picking up. We heard there was a little bit of a spinner bite, so we threw on spinners and leeches, and we started picking up some nice fish. And then all of a sudden, it got really rough. Well, we picked up like seven, eight fish. So today, we're going to bake some walleye. We're going to do uh, Parmesan baked walleye. We are going to be using some gillies right here. A local seasoning, if you're from the Middle River, Thief River Falls, New Folding area, you can pick it up. I'll put some I'll put some locations in the description below where you can pick up gillies. As it says right on the label. Right there, we'll see if we can get it to focus. This shit's good on everything. You can use it on steak, fish, pork chops, you name it. So some of the things we're gonna use, Azure's gonna show us what do you got there. What do you got there, buddy? Is that the seasoning? Is that the stuff? My good buddy Timmy. Let's see. You want to see? Yeah. You're on camera. Right there. See? <laughs> My good buddy Timmy Gill makes this stuff. So it's a local seasoning. All right, simple ingredients Parmesan, Gillies, real mayo, and walleye. We're going to show them how to make it, Azure? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Do you like walleye? Is it one of your favorites? Yeah. Awesome. You like being out in the boat? Yeah. All right, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna dry off the walleye to get that mayo to stick to it. If it's too wet, the mayo just kind of turns into a soup. It doesn't stick very well, and then in turn, the Parmesan doesn't stick very well. Can you do that, Azure? Yeah. Do it, you do it. Get that walleye dried off. Perfect, good job, high five. Yeah. All right, now that we got the walleye, see it's nice and dry. Then that mayo will stick a lot better. All right, so we're just gonna dump some Parmesan. The Azure's gonna dump some Parmesan on this plate. Good job, buddy. My dude, my dude. Sounds weird, guys. The recipe sounds weird using mayo, but it really works. Steph looked at me funny the first time we tried it too, and it's kind of the replacement for the egg. And you're just going to coat all sides of it, everything you can in Parmesan. Onto the tin foil, and then once we get uh, all the walleye on the tin foil, we'll season it. What's he doing in the background? <laughs> Parmesan up. We're gonna sprinkle it with some gillies. You guys can use whatever seasoning you want. Whether it be uh, Laurie's seasoned salt, garlic salt, mixture of your own kind. We got gillies. We got our walleye flays that we caught. We'll show you some clips of that as we were getting everything ready. Most of these were on Sunday, as you can see, they're bigger fillets. We got some nice fish. Um, yeah, throw it in the oven at 350 degrees. Like any walleye, just wait for it to start flaking apart. I can't tell you the exact time, but 350 degrees, wait for those walleyes to start flaking apart, and you're good to go. Throw it with any side you want. Super easy supper, way quicker than, you can have this done in the amount of time it takes to heat up oil. So, catch, clean, cook. We'll catch you guys in the next episode. We'll show it to you when it's done, what it looks like, but it's gonna be golden brown on top. The Parmesan's gonna be just nice and golden, and that's, uh, that's it, that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching, guys.